Hi everyone, John from Handlines Auctions. Hey, we're going to do a quick walkthrough of our Euclid auction on October 26th. There's a lot of stuff here, so make sure you bring your trucks, your manpower. There's a lot of scrap. If you're a scrapper, come on out. There's going to be a lot of here. Um, there's a lot to go through, so I'm going to try to do it as fast as possible. Uh, there's going to be a lot of pictures put online if it ain't already up. Before you see this, um, but there's a lot of different ouch, metal items, lead, stained glass, beautiful furniture, old Fisher Price toys, machines, woodworking machines. You'll see a bunch of them in here. Band saws, so circular saws. Um, Again, I ain't, can't get close enough to half the stuff because there's so much stuff. So you can check the pictures out online for an up more up close. The camera doesn't let me get up close enough. <clears throat> but there's bins, there's boxes, there's flats, there's tables. There's going to be everything and anything you could possibly think of going for auction. So make sure you check out everything. If you like lampshades, if you like stained glass, if you like tools, metal, old toys from Fisher Price, there will be a ton of it here for you. Alright, switch around. Another table. This is just the garage. We still have the whole house, the basement, some of the attic. So, again, make sure. You check out all the pictures going on the other side now and don't forget there's stuff up top areas he, he did a lot of different lamps try to fix them try to fi make them pretty and working some of the older stuff so this video will probably be ending up being like almost 20 to 30 minutes long because there's so much stuff um, so this auction again October 26th on the side let um, me back up since I have that on here in this area again hand tools October 26th in Euclid 1pm start time or preview time 2 o'clock start time I'll be here at 9 in the morning to move <laughs> stuff out probably um, to get as much as we can outside all these bins and shelves and everything that you see if they're not attached to the house they will be going um, even if they are attached to the house, they could probably still go. But you got a lot of tools, oil cans, just because you see it in the bin or a box doesn't mean it's going that way. 90% chance it probably will, but I keep tripping over the alternators and motors. One more set of tables in here. It's an old case there for advertisement. Some McCoys. Again, there's just a ton of stuff in here. And everything and anything will be going. Unless I say it doesn't. Like there's, I think, a fish in here that they're giving to the family. Alright, so before going up, we'll go down. So I can show you everything in here. Alright, so in this room, as you can see, there is a ton of stuff. So there are books and books and books and more books. Some in boxes, some on shelves. Most of the stuff, again, will be taken out the day of the auction. A lot of it will be staying inside. as well so if you have any questions regarding anything you can give me a call at 440-941-0078 send me an email at customer service at handlinesauctions.com or you can facebook message me as well through handlines auctions page again there's a lot of stuff in here Some nice, beautiful furniture that could be repurposed, redone. 
like one part of the barrister, I think. Looks what it looks like. I don't know, get the mic light on. Nope, doesn't let me do a flash. Go figure. I don't know. Okay. So, lamps and lampshades again. Pieces and parts. Stained glass, lead glass. Every little piece that he had in here will be up for auction. Again, October 26th, Euclid. Excuse me for a second. <coughs> oh, bless me. Thank you. All right. More, some more radios. Can't see that. Try to get that cut out for you. Again, single chairs. You're looking for projects. There's more projects here. So, somebody asked about the Eagle. Eagle, but... It's plaster. But it has a hollow to it in the wings. But the base is heavy. So, it's pretty cool. Here's a thing for you there. All right, moving on out into the basement. And again, you will see a ton of things in here. So everything is going except the appliances in this house, except for like one or two things that are still tagged. So if you do see them, they will not be for sale. There's only like two, I think a fish and a table or something. An incinerator, I think that was. Couple old stools. A lot of cool old things. Enamel tubs. Again, a lot of great items. This will be a long auction. Bring your chairs, bring your people to move all this good stuff for you. Bring a big enough vehicle. And we will get this all sold to you. Again, if you have any questions, give me a call. 440-941-0078. Send me an email at customerservice at handlinesauctions.com. Or like our Facebook page and send me a message. It's an 1800s drafting table. Pieces and parts are all there. That's what they told me. But that's all that. It's an 1800s drafting table. It's a pretty cool old JCPenney's toolbox. There are tools, tools and more tools, hand tools, electric tools. There are metal cabinets. There's metal cabinets all the way down. These were all filled with the stuff that is now on the ground. Again, lots of pieces and parts, a lot of cool things, a lot of tools. Vintage machinist box from the Miller Tool Company in Cleveland. The lid's right there by the door. Again, a lot of tools, a lot of nuts and bolts, a lot of scrap. Little Working bench, five inch workbench grinder. All right, so I think I got. Let's go up a little bit so you can see all the different things he's got hanging around that I keep hitting my head on. Again, if you don't want to fix them, you want to scrap them, you can. You want to pieces of parts it out, you're more than welcome to. You can do whatever you like. I don't want to keep shaking because my head keeps hitting it. All right, go into a little back room so you can see more little pieces and parts. So if you want some bolt organizers, there's some bolt organizers for you. Nuts and bolts. This was his little storage room for bolts and nuts. So there's a lot of stuff back here. The shelving will be going, whether you use it or scrap it, it's up to you again. But anything and everything, again, 
will be up for auction except for the appliances and the things that stay with the house itself. So, all right, this one's done. Turn my lights off as I go around, head on upstairs. On the way up. Hey. Hey. Up we go. Into the kitchen. We have locks. We have keys. Another Griswold grinder. There's a lot of grinders here. Kitchenware. Vintage cabinet that will be going. Does not stay with the house. Lamp, blender, old tubware, you can have all of it. Now we get into some nice, beautiful old furniture pieces. I like them. Cabinet, clock, artwork, table. couple black forest cuckoo clocks I believe that's what they look like then I pull them out February coffee nice old picture into the nice old mirror things in the little cubby holes <coughs> There's glass, there's pottery, bookends. Again, old tables, old furniture, nice rocker. Some nice, it's a nice bed that was upstairs. We put it in together so you can see the size of it. We will take it down probably the day of the auction to get people in here. An old basket, bed, crib. Now it's for dolls only. Remember, you put a kid in there, it's up to your own responsibility. glass crackle glass there it's a nice beautiful orange crush appears to be original does not to be a refab replica so working condition it's feels about 60 or 50 degrees in here 50 to 60 west clock a lot of great things pyrex screen Depression possibly could be uranium. I don't know. Don't have a black light. Doesn't look like it, but could be. Some Christmas ornaments. Crafts. Marble top table. Some, the uh, one was in the Air Force. One was in the Navy. A cigar. Nice big lamps. The lamp goes with the shade. Got a lot of great items. October's 26th, 1 o'clock preview, 2 o'clock start time. Check out all the pictures online, handlinesauctions.com, which you'll probably own it if you see it, unless you're on my Facebook page. And then you can click the link to be taken to the auction to see all the pictures. Uh, sign up for our emails on Facebook or on our website, and then you will just be notified when we have one and I'll send the links to you that time as well so like I said a lot of great items the old wooden Fisher Price people the old toys I'll bag those up for you some flags As you probably just saw the fish tail. That is not part of it. That is one of the things that is going to one of the family members. Right. And into the back room, one of the rooms. Like I 
this in. It's an Air Force uniform. Another uniform for you. Nice bench. Nice beautiful seat with the claw footing with the balls in it. Again, a lot of great items. October 26th. And also, if you're watching this, and I have it up before Wednesday and or Thursday and Friday. We have two online auctions. One for furniture out of our 1100 warehouse, and then smalls out of our 794 warehouse. One ends Thursday, one ends Friday. Take a look. Pickup is both the 20th, I believe, Sunday following. Uniform pieces and mm -hmm. uh, we're working on another one, a couple more online auctions. We'll be going to Independence today. That one will be for next in the next couple weeks. Um, they are moving out to Wisconsin and we're selling everything that's in the house. So take a look for wait and take a look for that one as well. And then we're the one you saw from Medina. He called back saying that they are now selling the house to the people prior. If not, he would still do the auction. So keep an eye out for that. I will be putting those pictures back up and we will be starting prepping that this week as well. That one is November 2nd. We have one for November 9th at our warehouse at 1100. That will be set up, and that one has three cars. You can bid on the cars absentee if you cannot make it to the auction itself. It will go to the highest bidder. The information is all online, so make sure you take a look at it. It's a Ford, Ford F-150, a Cadillac, and a Dodge Caravan. Then a lot of them do need some work, but the F-150 was the guy's main vehicle. That he was driving. He was also driving the caravan. So I'm keeping an eye out looking at. Different magazines. That's pretty cool. Got an accordion. It's a military. Alpha pieces and parts. Those were spread out onto a table. And nobody wants them. We'll sell them by the table boxes. You see, you know how we do it. It's all got to go. All right. There's a lot of records. 78s, 33s. Some pennants. Vintage pennants. Nice, beautiful library table. You can pull out drawer. Again, a lot of great items. Hope we see you at the auction. We got one more floor to go. It's upstairs, but I'm going to walk back one more time because I don't know if I did this portion. Some banks. There's a site surveyor. Equipment right there with the tripod. Gonna go upstairs, finish it upstairs. Not much up here, but we have to go through it for you. If you have any questions, again, give me a call 440 941 0078. Send me an email at customer service at handlinesauctions.com. If you want to consign any items as well, we do take assignments at our warehouses. You can bring it to us where you can pick, we can pick it up for a fee. If you need to buy something and you need us to drop it off, we can do that as well for a fee. Depends on how far you live and how much stuff you got. But I have a 14 foot box truck that we can definitely use it for you. We have some more steamer trunks, moving trunks, blankets, 
Christmas ornaments. The bedding. We're almost finished. Like I said, it'll be about 20 25 minutes worth of video. Again, a lot of this will be taken outside the day of the auction. A lot of the bigger stuff will stay where it's at, like we always do. Um, so, again, make sure you bring your main power. Make sure you bring big enough vehicles so you can take all this good quality stuff home with you. There, are a ton, there is a ton of stuff outside as well. Some could be flower pots, scrap, bricks, um, building supplies. Um, check out the pictures. That we have online for outside stuff um there'll be some probably other little pieces and parts that we find as we go through and pull things out so never know what surprises we're going to find for you so we hope you enjoy the video we hope we see you on october 26th here at euclid remember to bid online for our two online auctions that are ending this week and November 9th um, for the trucks. If not, we'll see you live for that. Again, we hope you have any questions. Give me a call. Want to sign? Let us know. We can do that as well. We take assignments all the time. But we thank you for watching. We hope you enjoyed the video. And we will see you at the auction. Thanks. Have a great day.